about a character named Bosco. Bosco was created in 1927 by Hugh Harmon and, and Rudolf Ising, specifically as a talkie. You know, now the people were specifically trying to make now animated, animated film shows and whatever films that could actually like lip sync and dialogue and talk. And, um, they were working for Disney originally, but then when they but they left and produced Bosco, uh, the Talk Inc. Kid. Um, Bosco was the star of 39 Warner Brothers cartoons before Harmon and, uh, and Issen took Bosco to MGM. Um, and after two MGM cartoons, the character received a dramatic makeover that was much less appreciated by audiences. And Bosco unfortunately ended in 1938. They then signed with um, Leon um, Schlesinger Productions and started the Looney Tunes series for Warner Brothers. If you've ever heard of Looney Tunes, um, this is kind of the birth of it, and um, Looney Tunes, because of these um, specific two people who were um, bringing, um, you know, their, their animation chops and starting a whole new, um, I guess, division of animation at Warner Brothers, um, they uh, have a slew of the, some of the most famous characters ever to come out of, um, you know, the world of Looney Tunes, including... Um, in, including a number of revolutionary films that came out of the studio as well, including Who Framed Roger Rabbit and Space Jam. Um, here's a little brief history of Looney Tunes, um, just because it's literally one of the most well-known studios ever. <laughs> 